Hello my dear learners! Welcome to our science class. For today, we will have another new lesson. We will talk about the ways of separating mixtures. A mixture of different candies. In order for us to separate the mixture, I am going to get all the chocolates Put it here to separate them using my hand. I separate the mixture using pan picking. Okay, that is pan picking. It is the method of which a mixture can be separated by just taking them out with the use of the hand. Next one, we have what's this video. Okay, this one is a mixture of flour with hard particles. So we are going to use the sifter to um, separate the mixture. So using the sifter, we can separate the mixture, the hard particles of the mixture. And this is what we call sieving. Okay, and that is sieving. Sieving is an example of technique for separating particles of different sizes. This is very famous and the instrument that we use in sieving is the sieve. Next one, let's have another video. We have rock salt and I'll pour water and try to mix this. Let's mix it until the salt will dissolve in the water. separate the mixture showing evaporation let the water boil the water starts to boil okay. and the water evaporates what is left is just salt And that is evaporation. Evaporation is a technique used to separate out homogeneous mixture that contain one or more dissolved salts. The method drives off the liquid components from the solid components. The process typically involves heating the mixture until no more liquid remains. Next. Let's watch this another video. Here we have mud and glass of water. I will pour the water. Mix. And then if we are going to separate the mixture, showing the foundation, remove the water. And leave them out. And that separating mixture is what we call decantation. It is the process for the separation of mixtures of immiscible liquids or a liquid and a solid mixture, such as a suspension. Next one. In here we have bottoms and tampons. We are going to use one. Magnetic separation is the process of separating components of mixtures by using magnets to attract magnetic materials. 
the process that is used for magnetic separation detaches non-magnetic material with those that are magnetic. That is how magnetism. Next is filtration. It is the method of separating an insoluble solid from a liquid. When a mixture of sand and water is filtered, the water passes through the filter paper. It becomes the filtrate. That is how filtration. Next, we have winnowing. Winnowing separates the grain from the husk because one particle is light and the other is heavy. When you are separating a light particle from a heavy particle, you may use winnowing as a method of separation. And that ends our lesson for today. I hope you learned something new for today. If you have questions or suggestions or maybe topic to request, just write in the comment section and I'll try my very best to answer it. If you are new to my channel, please click on the subscribe button and hit the notification bell for you to be updated on my next video lessons. Thank you! Bye-bye!